Who would I rather have a beer with or <laughs> not you, have? Who would you least want to have a beer with? Mar- uh, Marcus Mariota already won the poll, actually. Oh, he did? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Nobody wants to have a beer with that dude. Come on. Uh, I'd probably say Kyler Murray because chances yeah. are we probably aren't going to be talking too much. Oh. <laughs> oh, I'm going to no. ask a lot of questions. He'll look around to see if his dad will allow him to answer. Now, I have to take Kyler Murray and his dad out. So I got to pick up the tab for two people. What about Eli? Eli would be fun. See, he comes off as boring, you know, on press conferences and stuff, but he's he'd be fun to have a beer with. I remember having beers with Eli and Peyton in New Orleans. This is after his senior year at uh, Ole Miss. He's entertaining. When he's around Peyton, he's really entertaining because he feels comfortable. And and Peyton is a great storyteller. Okay, Cousins or Flacco? You have to have a beer with Kirk one Kirk D. Cousins or Joe Flacco? Wow. <laughs> yes, Tom. I think you got to go Cousins, even though it's a, I love my Broncos. But Cousins came on the show and he sang. He was willing to put himself out there embarrassingly. He, he seems like he might be a little more sociable and be willing to be a little silly. Yeah, but that was when he was in college. Different. I, he's driving around a minivan with seven kids he, as we speak at all times. He is Mr. Family Guy. Oh, let me see. I'm going to go Flacco. I'm going to, I'm going to, because I'm hoping that he'll tell me stories about the Ravens. Flacco's done one funny interview in the history of the world. It was with you <laughs> after the Super Bowl. You happen to catch him relax. <laughs> who else would be on that list? Okay. If you just had, who would you rather have beers with? I think Ryan Fitzpatrick, if he wins a starting job, is an interesting have beers with guy. You think he'd be fun? He'd either be real fun or not fun at all. <laughs> okay. I don't know if there'd be any in between. Harvard, but he's got a big beard and he looks like he's on Duck Dynasty. Yeah. Yeah, Paul. Goff's a bro. He would have some beers. He'd have some good talk. I don't know if Russell Wilson Jr. the third would be a ball of fun. Nah. He's not going out for beers. He's got to bring Sierra. That's in the. Yes. That changes. If he brings Sierra, then okay. If you add in significant others, that changes the poll completely. Tom Tom Brady's fun, right? You've had a beer with him. Yeah. Yeah. Brady would be fun. You know who I uh, think? Baker Mayfield? See, I don't know if he'd be as fun as you think he is. I saw him at a Super Bowl party, and he was quiet and well-behaved. Well, he needs to. I mean, you know, the public perception, you know, you're running from the law. You know, that, that you know, people still have that image, and they want to see if you're drinking, how heavily you're drinking. But yeah, he might be a little more guarded now. Who else, McLean? Uh, Mahomes seems like. What's you, up, Mahomes? I don't know. It's, he's got to get a beer out He's like more like hang out, play golf with. He seems obsessed with golf. Um, It'd be a lot more fun than you think. Mm -hmm. All right. Thank you, Todd. Thank you, Todd. Okay. A couple more quarterbacks (laughs) to have beers with. I'll give you Stafford, Rodgers, or Trubisky, the NFC North. Uh, I'd go Rodgers. Stafford, though, you know. Stafford would be a bro guy. He's a nice guy. You know, hat backwards guy. I I think Luck. Now, I've I've been out socially with Luck. Or um, with uh, Rodgers. And I and I think he's he can be sneaky funny. He's snarky, but it's there's always an interesting conversation going on. There's the you know, he got a lot of opinions and and uh but he's you know, not afraid to jab a little bit. So okay. I, Rogers would be fun. I do the NFC South last one. Our buddy Matt Ryan, who we got a beer with uh at Pebble, Drew Brees, Cam Newton or Jameis Winston. I don't know, Jameis Winston Ooh. probably not. Not this. He's got to step it up. Jameis shouldn't be having beers with anybody. Um, he might be the guy that I would just be curious. Like, how, how? I don't know how you tick. I don't know what goes on with you. Cam could be fun. To, he'd show up at the bar wearing something interesting, yeah, possibly. Yeah. He's probably got good stories. Matty Ice, Drew Brees. Brees might be, you know, looking at the bottle, seeing how many calories are in there. <laughs> he strikes me, as, you know. Now, if you have Jimmy G with you, obviously, that brings a whole new element that you'll have sort of women floating around your table. As, uh, as long as he doesn't bring the porn star out like he did in Beverly Hills. As long as he doesn't. Yeah. <laughs> yeah I just I, want to clarify. Yeah, yeah he doesn't. Well, some people may say the opposite. Yeah. For more Dan Patrick Show, tune in to Audience Channel 239 on DirecTV, stream for free on BR Live, or download the Dan Patrick Show app.